Welcome to this episode of Shop Talk by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I want to share this with you. So one of the things, uh, since I've moved, I've uh, built a new shop, etc. In, in my old shop, I had a lot of wired Ethernet connections back to my server uh, room and everything. Uh, because in my actual office, which is separated from my shop, is where all my servers are located. Uh, I don't have a bunch of them. I just have, uh, well, I guess I can't say, quite say that. I, I have one server and a bunch of actually NAS filers. And uh, one of the things in this move, I've upgraded uh, my Comcast service to full gigabit. And I'm utilizing the 802.11 AC. And I tell you guys, this has been crazy fast. And one of the things in the past, I've really run a lot of Ethernet throughout the house. And with AC, I haven't had the need to do that. And it's been kind of crazy. So uh, one of the things I'm doing for my shop is I'm actually installing another one of these uh, AC access points. And I kind of want to show you guys uh, what you get and everything. I'm not going to go into too much of the setup. But I just wanted to kind of share this because one of the pieces in the shop here... I actually run a lot of technology and I have a have a pretty good bandwidth connection back to my servers because for example the video that I'm uh, uh, filming this on that you're actually watching this is actually on a Wi-Fi enabled camera and it actually will be automatically uploaded to my NAS server so when I go back into my office uh, all this video will be there and this is the same thing for um, all my uh, time lapses and Basically, a lot of the stuff I do in the shop, or basically everything I do in the shop, is all videoed and sent over Wi-Fi to a NAS server. And one of the things I'm now using, instead of the, uh, you know, wired Ethernet, I'm just using, uh, you know, basically 802.11 AC uh, to move all these big video files. And it's actually been working out very good. I've been surprised. Uh, I've been a hardcore, um, you know, wired cable fan until AC came out and I figured I'd give it a try and I've been very happy with it and again I'm extending this so I just kind of wanted to share this so if you you know have a shop that's kind of separated from your servers or your NASs because come on as a YouTube producer I mean one of the things you have to have is a NAS I've actually running a couple different NAS filers uh, uh, one for I have a NAS filer basically for backing up all my videos I have a working NAS filer for all my pending videos and, and that's really the key producing YouTube channels is really just as much video as you can collect having it at your fingertips in an index format to be able to use and to do that you obviously have to move quite a bit and this is where the AC protocol really works out well and so with this um, this unit is about um, 64 bucks, and the nice part about it is it has the it, it is a AC access point. So I have the AC router from Comcast with a gigabit down, and this connects to it, and I can connect up to four different devices. Now, actually, in my office where I have the servers, um, I actually you know uh, chain another uh, switch off of this one. Uh, actually, I think like a 16-port switch and have all my NASs and servers and all that stuff attached to it. And I won't go into all the VLANing and all that geeky stuff. But, you know, if you're into this, you kind of get it. But at minimum, um, the piece that you can do is connect up to four devices uh, hardware to this in your shop area to upload this. So now what I do here is I have a uh, specific... Uh, uh, basically shop computer that collects a lot of the video and then plus wirelessly I'll connect to this to transfer um, video up into my servers and also kind of cache it here in the shop too initially so anyways I wanted to share this with you and kind of what you get and it's pretty basic uh, and setup is actually very easy on this guy now it does after you do the connection one of the things I found because I've got a couple of these already around the house uh, because they're handy for, you know, um, uh, media connections. I have one in my media room uh, because all my streaming is now, I used to use cables. Basically, with the, the event of AC 
and using these guys I've had really good luck at just you know basically cutting the cord cutting the cable uh, so anyways you know if you're running like octopi that kind of stuff I think this also works good in the shop setting because you can get really good connection back to here and then it's AC back in and when you're exchanging again large files this is what you want so this is kind of what you get power supply and unit out of the box it really doesn't come with any cables you get a few manuals setup is super easy with this guy so no big problem I like the aesthetics the looks of it really lightweight not uh, too big so Anyways, hopefully this helps you out. If you have a shop and you're looking to get strong wireless connection, I highly recommend this guy. Link down below, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, don't forget to swag shop up in the corner. Hit the subscribe button, bell, and we'll see you guys later. Cheers. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel to keep up.